Welcome to the Tepe News Hour. I'm Tepe News Reporter number one, and I'm Tepe News Reporter number two. And in today's news, former Tepe Ambassador to the CPAS, Minister of Public Distortion and Exploitation, and Ratio Miscalculator, Cheezle Weasel, has been appointed Interim President of the Republic of Tepe. Really? Parliament sure was quick to disassemble the monarchy. I mean, King wichinga has been dead for only three months. Now to the inaugural address of President Cheezle Weasel. Take it away, Tepe News Reporter number three. Hey, I know all you guys have been worrying about the changes we've been making, but they are for the best of the new Republic of Tepe. Don't worry about it. I like this new Cheezle Weasel. I see great things in Tepe's future with him at the head. Get out of my sight, man, Servant Fitzgerald! That diminutive ambassador shall never replace King Bachingo! Yes, sir, and you have a message. Hey, Professor Paposkis, it's Cheezel Weasel. I need you to come to the Mandatory Security Council meeting today. Ugh, Cheezel Weasel. Welcome, welcome, all members of the Tepe Security Council. Uh, General Cha Cha, why are you only here in a robot stand in? Governing border planets is a labor intensive job requiring constant supervision. Hey, what if I told you the new foreign policy I want to interact could solve our Fruvian border problem in days? That is impossible. The Fruvian exclave has been a threat to our borders for more than 30 years now. You can't solve it in five days. I spent five years during the days of the old republic on the Fruvian exclave's border. Those Frubes have a deep-rooted hatred for the Republic of Tepe. I believe a tree can be exchanged. The Tepe border planets with the Fruvian exclave are rich with minerals required in the production of bowls. I spent three months in the Fruvian exclave breaking up that very bull monopoly you want to reinstate. Hey, they only control 10%. Well, actually, the Republic of Tepe is the one with the monopoly. President Jesel Weasel, are you a Frubian sympathizer? You know, the Frubes are our worst enemy. My calculations put the Tepe troop casualty rate to Frubes is 200% higher than the next highest one. Settle down, everyone. This is exactly why I called this meeting. You guys aren't the government. And I, President Cheezle Weasel, will not be taking orders from a bunch of trigger-pulling generals. Preposterous! We military generals are the people who make up the cabinet of the government. Hey, you were three months ago, but I'm not King Bachingo. And General Pre Boskus, please put on the regulation uniform. I am not a Lieutenant High General. I am the High General of the Republic of Tepe. And you shall see that you respect my authority. My new cabinet didn't see the point to have one person in charge of the entire military. So you are now officially just a Lieutenant High General like everyone else. This meeting is dismissed. My Defense Secretary Phil will be giving you, you guys, your new assignments later this week. And none of you will question what Defense Secretary Phil tells you that you will be doing. That man is out to ruin us! There was a 90% chance he was going to discontinue automated service units, but I convinced him otherwise. There isn't a point anymore. I almost died in service for this. My only hope is, is that I get an easy reassignment and that he realizes that the rank of Lieutenant High General is to be taken not lightly.
We are the best Tepe has to offer, yet we give up so easily. Where is our pride? Will you so easily give up your dignity? Give it a rest, General Proboscis. At least they didn't fire you the way you're acting. And don't worry, being a lieutenant high general isn't all that bad. Sir, you have a message. Put it on the front view screen, Tepe Troop number 14. I don't really care. Greetings, General. I am Defense Secretary Phil, and I'm here to tell you that your new mission is to monitor the Gleep Blop Agricultural System with Minister of Agriculture Alphonse. A farming colony? I am the best Tepe has to offer. Sir, we are receiving another transmission. General Cha-Cha, what do you want? I won't be assigned to another five years of governing border planets. It was fine when I could blow up a colony of froobs and make smoothies, but sharing materials? No more. What are you proposing there, Cha-Cha? I am suggesting a coup d'etat. I can't listen to those froobs anymore. All they say is, What do you want, a sub-ranger? Where should we meet, Cha-Cha? This is a very delicate procedure, you know. Oh, I can't actually meet you, but my A200 unit will. I will have to send it on a subspace probe. It'll probably take about two months. Yes, yes, in two months I will retrieve your unit. Lieutenant High General Proboscis out. General Proboscis, you have arrived! I'm Minister of Agriculture, Alphonse, and welcome to Gleep Blob, the largest producer of Glifani. Why do I need to monitor this farming system? Well, the Vice President, uh, I forget his name, but when he heard this was the least active system that we own, he thought it was exactly for you. What do you mean it's the least active system we own? Well, you know, we're not boarding any fiber planets coming trying to steal our fiber. You know, it's just a generally peaceful place. Nothing really ever happens. I'm surprised such a high-ranking general like you got assigned here. I am the most skilled general in the Republic. Why am I stationed on the least active farming system in the whole galaxy? If it makes you feel any better, we're bordering that backwater solar system that contains that undeveloped blue marble, Earth. That farmer, over there, what's his name? Well, his name is Smith. Good, he's my new manservant. Professor Proboscis, you have a new message. I guess we better go check it out then. General Proboscis, this is Defense Secretary Phil. And sensors on Gleep Blop Prime are detecting a probe that is in a dangerous vicinity of crashing into the planet. Please investigate this before that happens. Of course, right away. Man, Servant Smith. Get the pride of Tepe ready. Don't you think that's a little much for a single probe? Nothing's too much for the glory of Tepe. Q7B4, engage the tracker beam on that probe. Why be so intricate? You seem to me to be a run and gun kind of guy. Lack established. Retrieving probe now. Content scan says there's only another A200 unit, though this one programmed only to display information. It's as if someone's trying to contact us. Yes, indeed, Tepe Troop number 14. Have it put into a secure holding facility. I'll investigate it myself. What if it's a trap, sir? There's been much internal turmoil these days. People representative. Fitzgerald can be quoted saying all unrest has been resolved. I have no time to lose, manservant. I must be going. 
You treat these units with great disregard, Professor. A unit is a unit, General Cha-Cha. Now, how are we going to uproot President Cheezle Weasel? Isn't it obvious? We take the Tower of Tepe by storm, hold a few hostages, till I can get some reinforcements. Like who, Cha-Cha? Well, you know, like a few girdles, one or two captains, at least ten majors. I'm sure a lot of people will hop on eventually once we get the word out. Anyone in particular, like say, General Hammerhouse or General Viax one Well, General Hammerhouse was assigned to foreign relations, and General Viax is currently Minister of the Interior. Quite time-consuming jobs. You don't mean Lieutenant Colonel Hubert is coming, do you? No, no, no. Lieutenant Colonel Hubert was gutted by a Froob commandos. And then while barely living, the Fiberman sucked up the rest of his fiber. <laughs> Good for him. Now we need to at least maintain the element of surprise. I have programmed a Fruvian attack message to allow us to slip in with a ZC-0500 while the defense perimeter is occupied preparing for nothing. I say we bring in some high volatile explosives. Well, the Tower of Tepe is built as if it was a ship and has its own shields. So we're actually going to bring poison gas. <laughs> To the glory of Debe! Whatever you want, Sparky! Incoming transmission, sir, from a question mark, question mark, question mark. Play it, computer. I know no one by that call sign. I see. You two are already playing your doomed Kurita. Tepe shall be restored. Eventually, sure. Your precious country will have to survive great wars, the return of old foes, and the returns of ones long thought dead. You will witness the fall of great societies, Professor Braboscus, only to be crushed in the end. You may win in the short term, but never the long. You will perish, Professor Proboscis.